right, late to the party. Um, not much of a small scale fan. I had uh, I got the Bronco um, TRX4M, and I just couldn't get into it. Um, we upgraded Michelle's, and she ended up breaking some parts on hers. Nice, I, I stole some parts off of mine, and it sat in a box. It's been sitting in a box in parts for a long time. Saw this. Thought I would give it a try because it's more crawler based as far, you know, versus what the TRX4M is. So hopefully, hopefully I like it. If not, it's probably, probably just spent a bunch of money that I shouldn't have spent. Anyways, it's uh, the brushless version with, that comes with the uh, NSD. RS100 micro server servo stickers. I'm not a big fan of this body. Um, I might uh, purchase the other body that comes with the brushed version. Um, charger controller. So I guess seeing it in person, the, the body's not too bad looking. I just kind of like the other body that they have with the brush version. I'm um, not sure what color I'm going to paint that yet. But yeah, there's there's a there's a hundred unboxing videos of this thing. Um, I don't know if it came with a battery. 360 mAh battery. I did order a 600 mAh battery. This comes with the brushless system. It's 2S capable. And that's the stock servo. Came with this servo too. I've already ordered a bunch of upgrade parts. Um, first one is the rear axle. This makes it so that you can flip the, the ring and pinion gear to the other side and uh, put this shaft on this other output on the transmission and that'll uh, get rid of the torque twist. So for that axle, that's 24018. Yeah, so I ordered some uh, 1.3 inch Klingon tires from Injora. Um, those are supposed to be delivered in a couple days. The uh, Silicone rings for them. Tire inserts have already showed up. Other upgrade is the drive shaft. I went with the uh, SCX24 uh, metal drive shaft. Um, hopefully, you can see the part number on it. Full bearing kit. Well, let me give you some some numbers. Sure, I'm, if you get on Heli Direct, all the upgrades kind of just pop up when you're looking at the car. For that's this is for the brass portal covers. Brass uh, wheel hex, uh, wheel weight, not wheel weights, but uh, yeah. High clearance links. Uh, aluminum, uh, <clears throat> aluminum on axle servo mount and uh, steering links. And then, uh, I think I already showed you the axle. I'm thinking I like I could just throw it in my backpack when I'm out crawling with my uh, tent scale stuff, and uh, you know, 
to whip it out and run it with it, you know, just see how it does. I, I just kind of find the, the smaller, the smaller scale rigs kind of underwhelming. Uh, like I said, uh, Michelle bought me the uh, TRX 4M and, and I just uh, couldn't get into it. And she also bought me an SCX24, and I just made her return it. So she, she's got herself a TR4M and an SCX24, and then my trx 4 ms in parts in the box. But, yeah, I couldn't get into them. But I saw this, and I really liked it. So I haven't, I didn't buy any aluminum axles for it for right now. I just figured I'd run plastic. Um, but I got, you know, a lot of the up, other upgrades that are important for will wait oh, that sucker won't even turn why won't you turn there we go yeah anyways Got some decent flex.